Okay, we're going to hit camera control. It's going to show you starting preview. And you can see my GoPro is sitting in front of this flower that goes on top of a perfume bottle I have. And I can hit record. And it'll start recording. It shows you the timer there. It shows you the battery life and that you're connected to Wi-Fi. You can click preview off. You can also click up here and it will turn it to full screen. Enable full screen mode. Your button down here to stop recording. And again, up here at the top, you have your I'm at recording 960 at 30 frames per second. It shows you have two hours and 40 minutes, I guess, of your battery life, your Wi Fi, or uh, that's record, record time, I'm sorry, um, your Wi Fi and then your battery life. Down here, you can click settings. And we already have preview on. You can click locate camera and I don't have my camera close right now to show you this but you can hear it it starts beeping and flashing and it'll locate it for you um, you have your settings right here which it tells you everything about your camera here and you can click on uh, say I want to change my resolution and click on it here and go uh, 720 60 frames per second, and that'll automatically apply it without having to go through all the menus. You can delete your last file or delete all your cards, which is also a format. You have your camera modes here. You have video, camera, burst, time lapse, and I believe this is the. Uh, I can't think of what that one actually does. I believe it's the delayed start for recording that starts at whatever time you have so that you don't get camera shake, but I can't remember for sure. And let's see, was that everything? That was everything under settings. Oh, here's another thing. On this main page, I, can't get, I can see it. Um, you can actually turn your phone, or your phone, your GoPro off and on with the app also. and your preview will pop back up here. And we can click full screen, and I believe, yes, it works in landscape mode and portrait mode both. Um, again, I'm on the iPad 2, and I'm recording this with the iPhone 5, so that's why I'm not showing an iPhone, plus it's easier to hit all the controls. Anyways guys, that was a quick look at the GoPro Hero 3 connected with the iPhone, or iPad, actually, um, an iPhone app. You can get it today, you just have to make sure you update your camera to be able to use the Wi-Fi connection. Alright guys, thanks for, like, or thanks for watching, please like and subscribe.